Hey all, this is Urs, and welcome back to The Long War. We're on this abduction. Things have been better, things have been worse. On the upshot, we dropped the uh, Psychopod pack. Not the upshot, there's still more on the map, but... You know, things like this we've dealt with. Ah, estamos buscando el meldo. I don't know how much of that's gonna last. I'm just not gonna make her jet up yet. Unless something gets weird. Repair servo's doing the work. And let's see what else we got. Repair servo healed all the way up. That's not bad. Not bad at all. That meld is still there. We could probably snag it with Escobar if we want to put her in a dangerous position. I kind of don't want to put her in a dangerous position at this point. Your get up there. Come on. You'll be back in the We're ASAP. quickly healing ourselves as much as we can after this. Again, I'm not really that hard up for meld right now. Even with all the gene modding I'm planning on doing, we should have more than enough to go around. So I don't really need to push for that dangerously. How fast is it spinning? Let's see. That might expire like in a turn. So if I'm gonna do anything to get that meld, it's gonna be likely to jump a mech up top and do it that way. Cause Tron can get a jet boot module. Yeah, you can jet boot module up here. And if anything really untoward happens, we can always grab the meld there with the next move. Let's jump right up here. And if the meld is still the next turn, we'll grab it with the trong. Oh, I get extra, extra mobility here. Boink! That's triple rocket in one turn. You only get that here on a long war. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to set this overwatch yet. Looks like we didn't trigger anything through here. I kind of have expected to. But I do hear thin mans. I'm not sure where the hell they are at this point. They must be in this alleyway or something. I don't think we would have triggered them. It's kind of bizarre, not gonna Moving lie, out. but alright, whatever. Thin man deployments are sometimes weird. Let's leave it at that. Holding cover position. Alright, what else do we need? Who do we need? Riven, again, if there's a Already chance at a there. capture, I want her kinda close by. Morse, get over here. Get a reload. Smena magazina! Something about my mouse, a change of magazine. I know what that says. I know my Russian isn't that bad. It's close, but not that bad. Right, lock it in. Il est prêt. And we got this. And we got the Chong. All the Chong. All, all the Chong. And since we're not moving anywhere else, let's overwatch our main units and see where the Thin Men are, because I'm kind of curious. They're around. They're behind the building. That's why I haven't seen them. I think I heard something. Tip tap, 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 tap. Tip tap of. Thin man feet. Oh yeah, the meld is still here, so let's I grab it. Commander. Why the hell not? While we got Target it, captured. while we're young. Alright, so not that much meld, but that's good news for alien supply numbers. It's actually going down, which is excellent. That. Pretty clear, but I want to set up nice positions on all these doors. So when we do breach, if we don't see the thin man, great. If we do, then we're ready. Let's see, Ray, last healing bit on... Yeah, we took a bunch of damage here. It's kind put of really frustrating. It. Put a plaster on it. But once we put a plaster on it, we'll be fine. Where is my mammy? There you are. I found you. All right, that's fine. Let's get uh, Escobar. Could you sprint up? You have jumpy legs, right? I think all my snipers are now equipped with jumpy legs. Yeah, they are. Okay. I'm going to sprink right up here. Just so we can get at the thin man when we need to. Sprink. Oh shit. That was bullshit. Really? Really? Wow. 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 Wowie, wowie, wowie. Okay. Well, raise your hand if that blows the big one. That is insane. Okay then, friend. That's a distinct problem. Okay. Okay. My sniper isn't dead yet. Didn't I just see through here with Chuang and there was nothing there? And suddenly, now that it actually matters, there's something there? I mean, luckily we didn't burn all our moves yet, but we came pretty freaking close. That is utterly ridiculous. The level of bullshit is just too damn high right now. Alright. Well, we need our mech to get in here and toss a grenade up to deal with those thin mans, because that's going to be a problem way. otherwise. That is ridiculous. That is not awesome sauce. That's the opposite of that sauce, actually. Let's get this cleared up so Chong can take two shots on them. 
Okay, that's a kill. That's good. Who has a flank? Yorg. Did I see a flank on Yorg? I did. Trong's got one. This allows him to take at least one clean shot here. With hit and run. The high ground thin men are down. How many thin men actually have eyes on my sniper? That's my concern. Two. What? No, one thing has eyes, and that's that jackass in the corner. Which one is it? That thin man by the meat stack. Okay. Well, we can handle the meat stack pretty well, I think. Let's get a grenade down. We are a sapper grenadier here, so obviously we can deal with meat stacks. Get rid of that. I mean, the mine controller is going to be up and running, so that's a little dangerous, obviously. Alright, but the covers are down, and that was the whole point of that. York's going to have one good shot, Chuang's going to have nothing, and then after that, we're going to have to figure out how to deal with it. But first and foremost, I'm going to make sure that the thing that has eyes on my sniper no longer exists. That's going to be key. Alright, and then... I'm sure what Chuang is going to be able to do beyond Overwatch. Because he can't quite move where he needs to. Alright, so let's see what happens here. They should kind of scatter like the roaches they are, so... I could I'm lucky they're gonna focus on the mech, which is just out there wagging its dong at them. Yeah, it looks like that so far is panning out. As long as not everything shoots the sniper, we'll be okay. Okay, that one is double mind merging, or mind melding, or mooning. Aw, oh, you jackass. He's gonna try to take a ping at my sniper, isn't he? My position nope, is just my mech. That's fine. Right, that could have been a lot worse than it was. Like, a lot worse. The hell? Oh, there's another sector back there I didn't see. Okay. Did you move already, you little jackass? Fire over here. Okay, guess not. Are we done now? Is, is the bullshit been sufficient? Okay, good. So where is my little friend? My little friend is here. So Chuang is going to make my friend have a really bad day. So Chuang, get right Heading here. There now. It's going to be fun. Hi. Fancy meeting you here in a place like this. Do you enjoy shotguns? I do too. You're really pretty. Sorry, that's my my mech attempting to pick up a sectoid commander line. It's not very not very good, I know, but it's weird. Why is this okay? Can I strike? Can I strike him? Kill him. Right through the door. I should kill another Yep, fried him. Fried that one. We fry the other guy? No. Okay, so what is still left here? One thin man, one sectoid, one sectoid command. There's another sectoid commander out here! I had no idea. Where is that little punk ass? You're just a normal sectoid though, aren't you? Ain't you just a normal feller? Kinda thought you were. Okay. So where is he? Interesting. I did not actually think that was a thing. Morris, can you try to flank out this guy? Morris gonna get an easy flank out on him, but no, yep, it's this. He's right here, son of a bitch. Okay, let's take a swing. Ten damage, not awesome. Kinda was hoping for more. I'm totally gonna run the suppression though, because that's not really worth even worrying about at this stage. Thin man's gonna be a little annoying, but there's really not much chance for capture here. I know some country wanted. Hmm. We could try for the cap, technically. We can maybe... The Thin Man's the, the odd one out. We can get Riven right here and attempt to capture. And Ray should be able to command, I think. That would be pushing it, though. Huh. We can just drop the Thin Man like this. Do some damage to not ourselves, hopefully. Drop a thin man a little bit. Just a little less pain on this end. A little less pain on this end. Wow, it's going to be pretty tough to do, huh? Okay, it's got to be up here then. Like that. Alright, that'll work. Let's clear the thin man's cover. That's really the only factor here. The other sectoid's not a big deal. I am keen on keeping the sectoid commander somewhat alive, though. Oh, God. Morris is flanked now. Really? Okay, well, this makes it easier for Ray to actually get a command in. So you'll probably have line of sight when Riven tries to get up right there. Yeah, he probably will. Let's get Ray up here. Notice my total lack of concern about positioning here. 
Ribbon, let's try to get a nice cap. So how do we get that guy boiled down to a cap position? Well, Escobar is going to have a line on that little sectoid through this window, I'm pretty right. sure. Let me get her over there. Hey, little dude. What's up? 90%? That'll do. If this doesn't kill him, I'm going to be really pissed. We missed the 10%. No, we got him. 19 crit. I'm pretty sure he didn't last after that one. All right. So we have two charges of command. We have one charge of Mammy. And we have one charge of Riven. So we could get Riven here. It's unlikely that's going to cap. I need to whittle it down. I need to whittle that sectoid down. How the hell are you going to bother doing that? I mean, this is not a flank. But... Odds are still pretty good. I can do some damage to him. You got some DR. Oh, that was a pretty good shot. I'm kind of sad you missed it. 80%. See, that's going to do too much already. I really wanted Mammies to connect. Shoot buckets. Alright, well, we can try for the capture. The odds are going to be pretty low here, but we can always try it. And if not, we can always try and execute. Alright, command it. Riven, try for the cap. It's going to be 9%. Oh, it's way too low, man. Even at that is way too low. Mine phrase not going to happen. 0%. Maybe we'll roll low. I don't know. We could roll really low on a gun. Never mind. York's too good. Down. Excellent work. Yeah. I mean, I could have tried the nine percent. It might have worked, but at this point, yeah, whatever. If I was playing totally, totally optimally, yeah, I would have. I would have at least rolled the nine percent before executing with York. But that was more along the lines of let's make sure we can get Riven out of the nasty position first. I hope all of our deployments go this well. Yeah, me too. All right, uh, tandem warheads, rapid fire. No, not on this build. Light them up. Yes, on this build. So light them up. Done. Good. That's so we can shoot and then throw a grenade at the same turn. All right. So 12 meld, not bad. Ah, we didn't get the capture we wanted. That's all right. 138. Panic in Oz is down. Not too bad. Not too bad. So I mean, what is bad is what's going on in North America. You're bad, and you should feel bad. It's not very, not very good. But, all right, you know what, I'm going to rename you just so I don't see Raven 33 there, okay. So we have currently, what? We have two in Africa, which makes sense because that is pretty high on panic. We need more in North America and we need more in Europe. Now I'm going to put a third one in North America just because apparently if they're sending bombing runs with battleships, I'm going to need some extra firepower up here. That's all I'm saying. So, yep. Command and control is coming out in a couple turns. Let's get the ball rolling. Ten heavy floater corpses for Egypt. Egypt actually needs more shield, doesn't it? Let's see. Egypt. Yes, Egypt definitely needs more shields. We're definitely doing that. Yep. Dispatch the items. They're called wrecks here. And their corpses there. More or less the same. Let's not worry about political correctness. Plasma pistols can't do, can't do, and we're not doing that. Alright. Well, that's the decision. Alright, command control is done. So we can now build the Gollop Chamber. There we go. And mind and machine. This is where we get the uh, the super armor for psychics. It's nice. Nice. Now let's do mind and machine. There you go. Vaughn has nothing else to do anyway, so. And now we gotta see when those terror ships come around. Contact detected. Scout target South Africa. Alright. So we're saving the fusion lance and the plasma cannon for the terror mission. Tear. So we're gonna let Major Panzer do this with the name module. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Get him. Get him, Bob! Get him! Come on, come on! Don't let him run away. Oh, if he gets away, I'm gonna be very pissed. There you go. Aim module, please. Thank you. I'm gonna abuse the hell out of these aim modules while I can. There we go. Done, skis. So he's going to be out for damaged. Okay, fair enough. We We're going to quickly start build. We on the housing for this device as soon as possible. Considering what we went through to get it, we should be making every effort to provide a secure location for its storage. Thank you, Shen. Well, you know, I'm working on that really, really hard. All right. So what can we build? We can build that gallop chamber now, right? Yeah. Let's see. Probably going to be down here, honestly. That way we can get a workshop or laboratory as need be. Definitely not a lab, though. Uh, all right, let's see. Gallop Chamber, how much? 1,000 credits and 35 power. God damn. That's not cheap. Okay. Okay. I can I can see how that's going to be a little while, but that makes sense. I need to build up 
some of my firestorms, get my psychic ability, my troopers up. Wow, that's a lot of money. Okay, and that's even with the workshops and stuff. Jesus Christ. Okay. Anyway, 35 power we need. So we're currently sitting at 16 residual power. So we need to pull off a fission jenny and probably drop a Illyrium jenny in there. Yeah, this will bring us down how much? Yeah, okay. And then we're going to put an Illyrium generator there. Because we're obviously going to need power. We need 280. We'll get 50 credits, no problem. Easy enough. Well, that thing is, that thing is, uh, it ain't cheap. <laughs> I'll give you that much. It ain't cheap in meta material. Drone Rex. I don't really need Drone Rex because we don't need to track anything anymore. The captives we have a lot of. Let's get some web fragments sold. I really don't need that many of these anymore either. Hope your ears aren't bleeding yet, but they probably are. So sorry. Just give them a hundred at a time. Make things easier. All right. Let's build that thing. That's going to improve power by how much? So Illyrium generator, 35 power. And that'll give us plus three for every adjacent power facility. So that's going to do the power requirement for the golf chamber easy. I need 35 power. So that's all we need. Okay, good. Do it, baby. 25 days. Okay, I mean, we still need to, you know, space marine people. So that's still going to take some time. I don't mind the thing just building itself out normally. Okay, so that'll be enough power for the golf chamber. Obviously, we're not going to be able to freaking staff this thing in any way, shape, or form besides then. All right, cool. We have an extra slot in our facilities. That's how efficient we've been. Oh, joy. All right, anyway, onward. Onward and upward. We're researching. We're researching. We're researching mining machine. We are. Okay, good. Do it. More. I need more. High, medium, short. God, they really want Canada. We can't do anything about this. Shoot. Can't do anything about this. They're pushing so hard on Canada. It's ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. All right, so they're going to shoot that satellite down. They'll put a satellite immediately back up. So they don't get to harvest at all. Ah, four days out on Commander Pasha. Well, we're gonna go up and say hi, but it's just for the sake of appearances, nothing else. Oh, I really, I really don't like that. And that's why we need a third one. They're pushing North America hard. That's definitely where my third Bangs out. firestorm's going. No joy here. Let's get out of there. That's gonna definitely get a shoot down. We don't have stealth satellites, so. Contact detected. And we're scouting target in Mexico. Wow, get bent, guys. Can't do anything about this either. All right, go up and say hi, but... Look at how hard they're pushing North America. It's just really rough, and that's where I'm building my Firestorm, so it's very easy for them to do so. Engaging bogey. All right, I got nothing. I can't even bother trying to take a destroyer down right now. That's like a tiered up medium guy. Commander. One of our satellites okay. is no longer responding okay. to Okay. Wow, that much panic from a shoot down? Come on, guys. Monitoring has pulled their funding as a result. Come on, guys. Launch satellite here. Launch the Sati. Yup. Satellite uplink facility. That's surprising. Oh man, that shoot down is really expensive on panic. That sucks. So they're basically trying to they keep trying to break my North America bonus, which I mean it's a good strategy. It's, oh, it's such a pain in the ass. Scraping the cash together that golf chamber is gonna be a bitch. Alright. Well, I wish we had a Canadian thing we can complete here. With India, Germany, who doesn't need it at all. Power sources from the US, and again, that's not gonna happen. Do I have three or four power sources in storage? Bullshit. I have five. What? What happened? Wait. The latest contact turned out Wait. to be Wait. Probably just another drunk pilot who fell asleep. Wait, on did I not? Wait, Illyrium generator, right? Oh, balls. That's right. They require alien power sources. Okay, right, 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 right. No, that's absolutely true. Okay, so I guess we don't have <laughs> another firestorm to build. Well, on the upshot, that lets me free up some stuff to put more people in the gene lab. Who else are we putting in there? I gotta start checking these people off, make sure we have them all fully done here. So that'll be that. That will be Zoid right there. Don't need it for a Pathfinder. Alright, one of our gunners is gonna come in here next, and that's gonna be Dane. So 
Yeah, yeah. You'll eventually figure out who I'm taking on the last mission from all this. But all right, Dane needs to get in here. Macrophages, hyperreactives, a double tap. That's going to be very important. Uh, neurosympathy or secondary heart. I'll keep secondary heart on. Uh, Bioelectric, iron skin. Oh man, I have to get cash. Gosh darn it. The things I have to do in a strategic map. Uh, all right, let's go just get some Ode to Berserker out of here. Okay, we good? Just get some Berserker corpses? Cool. All right. Try that again, please. Research. Gene Lab. This person. Dane needs to get in here. Get him in there. So, Macrophages, Hyperreactives, Secondary Heart, uh, Iron Skin, and Bone Marrow or Muscle Fiber Density? Hmm. <sighs> I always debate this, but it's always better for wound reduction and everything like that. I mean, we have pretty tanky anyway. Yeah, you know what? Let me just take the adaptive. It's going to be useful. I confirm the gene implant. If something goes really bad in that last mission, like that last little bit of heal is going to help. So go ahead. Thank you, Commander. I'll have the volunteer yeah. prepped and the volunteer. ready for search shortly. I'll send word when the procedure is complete. All right, you know what? And since Wolf is just kind of here waiting, I might as well put Wolf in there. Finish modifying him up. Let me get some cash, though, still. Uh, gray market. Let's sell up. Um, ba -doom -da -doom -da -doom. What can we sell? What can we sell? That's a good question. Seeker X. I guess we can sell Seeker X. I don't really need these for much of anything. And some Mectoid cores. Yeah, let's do that. That should be more than enough cash for our gene modding. All right, gene lab. Add soldier. Wolf, get in here. So macrophages... Uh, definitely, I mean, uh, you know, I almost think that having adrenal neurosympathy for a wolf would be a good idea. I don't know how big the AoE is, but wolf gets so many damn kills, and he's usually out of range of retaliation. I'm going to try adrenal neurosympathy here. That makes a lot of sense. Bioelectric skin or iron skin, uh, no brainer on the iron skin. So confirm those gene implants, please. 20 days, 55 credits, 52 mil. Done. I'll have the selected volunteer sent to right. surgical prep immediately. Once Anyways. the genetic modification is complete, I will notify you directly. Thank you, Valen. All right, so now we're still waiting for anything we can do Content up in... detected. God, I told you, they saved all these for the end of the... Where are we? In France. It looks like it's over Africa. I was thinking it might be a bad idea. All right. Should I do another UFO? Sh I mean, another satellite shoot down here? They may. We should be able to drop this with just a quick aim module, though. Man, they really are pushing the end of the month here. And they, they did stack all the missions and all this UFO stuff here, so. We're in pursuit. Ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Satellite assist acquiring targets. We shouldn't take much damage here, hopefully. Yeah, we, we armored off all of that. Light damage. That should be like a day, if that. Didn't even register. Uh, let's quickly go and build another A module then. Where's the A module? Where are we? There we go. Oh, we're glad we started building more of these because apparently we need more of them. Let me just get another one in there while we're at it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's, like it's all stacked up here. This is getting a little messy. Dodge done. Dodge is done. Dodge is done. Aim is done. There's gonna be a lot of that sound effect going on. Oh my gosh. Ears are bleeding slightly. 50 mil for 375 credits. Ah, uh, you know how much mel it costs to amp up all these people? It's taking it's taking quite some time. So you know what? We're not gonna do that. No. Nigeria though. God damn, I kinda wanna do that though. It just costs so much mel to do everything I need for the Space marining of my people. That's officially the term now. All right, Nigeria works. Uh, I'll think about it. I have 13 days to decide. Some ridiculously long pending request, right? Yeah, 13 days. I will. I will consider that. If we get another chunk of meld from something, I'll. I'll worry about it. All right. Anyway, keep going. Plasma cannon is done. That's going to definitely go on one of our new firestorms. Let's see. Did I forget something important here? I don't think I did. No, you're already arming. That's fine. Commander Poacher's got that on. Plasma Cannon. So I'm going to save that Plasma Cannon in here. There's no point in me putting it on an Interceptor just in time for this to be done. About seven days and seven days after that. And we're going to have to rip the Plasma Cannon off of Colonel Buster here and put it on there. 
That's all right, though. Okay, that's fine. I'm just going to let that one sit for now. I'm trying to be efficient with this. Wait, who's in the gene lab again? Zoidberg, Dane, and Wolf. Right, right, right. Get that down. Okay, good. Onward. I'm taking notes here as we start preparing toward endgame. Contact it's not going to be immediate, but it's going to be soon. Research, nap of the earth, small. Okay. I'll take an easy kill on Buster then. Don't want to give him any research. That would be unfortunate. Keep setting up on balance, keep using the aim modules. Like I said, I have money and I have floater corpses to burn, so I'd much rather just get guaranteed Enemy simple kills on all of this. That one could be landing, come to think of it. Enabled. But we're gonna just kill it. Done. Oh, we got alien crew no matter what. Okay. That would have been a trap. Look at this. 14 after the shoot down on a small scout. That would have been a trap landing. I'm glad we shot it down, actually. So what do we have? Floater, heavy floater, muton seeker, outsider. Freaking marvelous. All right, the other question is, do how many of these do I have? And these being the outsider shards. Three more. Okay. That should last me. I'm thinking, with all those floaters, I'd rather just have rockets than anything else. So let me grab in here. All right, rock on. Rock it on. Where is that? Guardian. We'll get the Guardian as our mech out, so that way we can justify having an engineer with zappy capabilities. I think that makes sense. NG, where are you at? Night K9? You're explosive? I always ask this question, but no, you're exactly what I need right now. All right, perfect. Uh, so we need another mech kind of can shooty shoot. Fight, 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 fight. Itchy and scratchy, sure. All right, where are we? Where's my, my mech? I can take the Reaper out. I guess Reaper hasn't had his day in the sun for a little while. Get the old team back together. Yeah, that makes sense. How much time? One day for the Shogun still. Okay. No worries. Let's get Reaper out. Why not? Or we can get someone really solid out. Ah, yeah, Reaper's totally good enough. The Guardian, Engineer, Valkyrie. Though he's got reactives, though, right? Last time we had anyone with reactives, people died. Oh, crap. That's right. And the Marauder has reactives also, so I'm probably not the best for captures. And the Valkyrie has reactives. Damn, who can we take? I guess we can take Sugar. She doesn't have reactives. That's fine. Let's take Sugar, then. <laughs> as odd as that is. All right, uh, so we have Engineer, Mech, uh, or Medic Mech, rather. We have an Assault-type role. Let's go with the Infantry-type role. I guess Krungle can command this one up. <sighs> All right, now Scout, Sniper, and then the rest. The whole shubba -da bang Where are we? Are we repairing? Okay, so we can use long range if we need to. We can probably take some of our baby snipers. Take Natty Janitor out. She's almost there. She's almost uh, in the zone mode. That's not bad. All right, we need a Scout. Probably going to be Leif at this point. Yep, he's good at these uh, landing missions to give us a good scouting. And then we need the rest of the fun. Gunner slash Rocketeer. So who can we take? We can take Plank Bob, who's still not a Master Sergeant, but will be after this damn mission, unless I have something to say about it. And then, last but not least, we have the Gunner. Dorn we don't need out there. Tyler, not quite. But that's probably the best we've got right now. Ash. We take Ash. But we have dedicated Shred with the Rocketeer, so we don't need Ash to fill that role. Take Honest Chewy to keep the Gunner Hope alive after her comrade in arms who came up in the same uh, same class of XCOM together got wiped by Muton Elite. Not fun. Not fun for anyone. Particle Cannon. Resto Mist. Grenade. Grenade. And then the usual stuff, carbide core, and a little bit of BC to make everybody feel nice about themselves. All right, NG. Since we're gonna run a rocketeer, you're gonna need to run a carbine, buddy, sorry. I know, I know, you wanna run faster, but the carbine's gonna have to do. So again, we're digging back a medkit. Feels like you're made to work with Zyther, aren't you? It's kind of funny how that jives out. Uh, Arthur, fine. Good. Shogun, Vindy, get me the particle, and then the usual shtick, Electro Pulse, Flamethrower, KSM. Flamethrower is so good at setting up captures, though. I really wish there's going to be a good opportunity for it. I may have to run the Outsider capture here, though, just because that dude, that dude's going to be dodgy, and we need an extra one in case we start losing too many continents to panic. It's going to be a bad scene otherwise. Get that walker servo, illuminator gun sight, and chitin plates. Thank you. Snipe ore. Load out with Archangel. Uh, reflex. Because you're the disabling shot type. Yeah, you are. 
Oh, I know your type. Uh, plasma Maul, in case something closes with you. Neural. Uh, bipod. And the Stellarator. Where is that? The Stellarator is less critical on Natty since she doesn't have in the zone. But she's pretty much the only slot we have on that. That makes sense, so, yeah. No worries. Alright. Life. Get me the standard rifle on you, I think. Yep. And then get the rest of the usual shtick for you in your scout roll, chameleon suit, and some chitin plate. Come on. Wow, where are we at? Come on, guys. There we go. Solid. Rocketeer plank bob. Archangel. Storm gun. Blaster. And neural. Perfect. And honest chewy. Load out Titan. Could justify the dragon here. I think I'm gonna do that actually. Plank Bob. You don't need the Archangel to be effective, because you can just go from anywhere. Get the Titan on. Chewy, get the Archangel on. And that way you have the Dragon, you have Walkers, you have AP. How much HP is that? That's 16 HP. Shit, that's low. Alright, I need this. But if you want to hit anything worth a damn, you're going to need an aim boost. But you're not psychic yet, are you? Yeah, you, you're still at kind of that issue where you're not psychic yet. Okay. Well, you ain't going to get psychic anytime soon. So we're going to have to do it that way. Our movement's at least 10. And now Harris is at 19 HP, which is a lot better than it was. And this does ridiculous damage, so the loss of the AP ammo won't be so bad. Okay. I think that makes sense. Uh... Wait a minute. What the f- They load you- Put you in Aegis? How dare I? Alright, there we go. Oh god, you all are probably screaming at the screen for that one. Like, why'd you put him in Aegis armor? He's gonna die! Now I'm paranoid checking. 26 is definitely tightening. Alright, we good? We good. Uh, let's try for a capture. What the hell? Why not? They gave it to us. What are we looking at exactly, though? Just to make sure. Five distinct species. So here we go. Seekers and outsiders, mutons, heavy floaters and floaters. So if I can grab a plasma rifle or the outsider capture, I'd be pretty happy. So this is definitely a good capture mission. All right, let's go. Let's give it a try. Let's see what happens. At 14 A's. 14 A's. Let's do it right. Dropship has arrived. December 24. And remember, there's still two terror Brazilian missions to go this month. Have requested two. Our help. So, so that's where we're messy going before next. it gets better, I think. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. Sparsely there are civilians populated, in the area. Eh? I hope they stay clear. I hope they stay clear too, Bradford. I really, really do. But man, now it feels like it's almost weird as we start pushing toward endgame. We start, you know, picking out the folks that are going on the last mission. I have my, you know, plan in my head here. Hope nothing goes wrong. With the folks that I want to send out, no one dies suddenly. Ugh, oh, that'd be awful. Alrighty. This is Big Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Just north, huh? Ain't you just special? We'll monitor those readings from here. Alright, Leif. Strike one is Talk to me, buddy. To the alien craft. We got... No vision. There's no way to get... Is full cover here on this side? Yeah, just keep that stealth on. Okay, nothing coming. And we're in a corner, more or less? Kinda sorta. Kinda sorta. But there's nothing near us and nothing got picked up on the scanners that way, so I'm kinda okay. I'm not gonna push anyone past Leif because I've seen that go bad before. Just like people Head played Knocky Spoonie before. Um, I will get you elevated when I see fit, but there's no purpose to keeping you Running. in blue moves that you can't do a damn thing anyway. But sure. Yeah, we'll see in a second. Plank Bob, yeah, just get kind of back here and start getting ready for your shots. Krungle, get up here to cover. Jaw, get back here to support. It's either who apparently the screen hates to select, get up here. Alright, let's drop a little bit of Overwatch. A little bit of something, something. Let's see what we've got. I mean, there's a crap ton of floaters here, we know that. But we also don't know where they're at, so... Scary, scary. Well, let's keep keep the motion track on in case we start triggering some. Get triggered. Yeah, Revealed. Why? Oh god, it didn't go directly into. Oh god, that would have been horrible. Well, wow, that's scary mouse misclick there. I'm on it, Commander. We do see a piece of meld. It could be where the UFO is as well. So we'll see. All right, get up here. Is either. 
Krungle, get up to this cover. On the, move. the scary part about 14 aliens and not seeing any is that that all could be just two packs of like seven sitting on top of itself. It's not going to be because there's the outsider pack, of course, but still, I don't like when they compress themselves into a tightly oh, packed right. ball of hate. It's not really, really good. Let's get you up this yes, way. Sir. Come on, one of these days. Uh, get up there. Solid. All right. Except for honest Chewie, right, because you can't do that. All right, get up here with legs. There's nothing anywhere near us, so. Yeah, yeah, there's floaters. Okay, they're slightly to the right of us, then. Did you hear something? Oh, I did hear something. Uh, I hear something. All right, Leif, can you get up there to this tree? You can. All right, let's see. Where are the mutons at? Okay, got him. Okay. So, we have intel on the enemy position. What is this? This is Seeker Double Muton. Looks like ripe for a capture opportunity, if I do say so myself. So, Natty, get your ass airborne. Pack is hot. Pack is hot. And how. Right, get up here. Are you going to see anything from here? You're not. This is great. This is good news. Okay. This is wonderful news. All right. Get up here. No line on any of this, huh? Scary, that. Still no eyes. Really? I am duly surprised, but okay. I kind of thought there'd be eyes on that by now. All right, Chewie, get up. Got to gotta get up. Get down. Let's get up right around here. High as possible. That big old gun, that dragon is going airborne. It's gonna be pretty. It's gonna be so pretty. Get up there. Nice. Okay, we'll see how that drives. Now we'll try to avoid taking contact while simultaneously sneaking up. up. Keeping to big heavy cover okay. as needed. Zyther, stay. And then you won't take vision from here, right? Yeah. We shifted over pretty intensely, so I want to keep everyone moving while we've got it. Right there. Let's get right around here. Okay. Haul dat ass. See what happens with this pack. Is that a Zerker back there? No, it's just kind of. It's just the fire is making him look kind of angrier than he is. Leif. Oh, you don't have, they don't have eyes on you from here, so technically you can still move and give me vision. Anything else I need to worry about? Nope, just that pack. It's a lot more there than I thought it was. But you don't have vision of it, so that's alright. Ah, there we go. That's where the pack's at. Alright, we can probably start this off with a nice big old rocket to end any discussions of whether we'll kill them or not, and then we'll try to isolate a lone muton and zap him. Target locked. Target locked, baby. Let's let that one go. Let's let that one go! Or something along those lines. Is every Scotsman in the audience wants to kill me? Let me talk. Speaking of isolation. Il va wow! Did you just. Plank Bob, did you just evaporate that entire group and put the remaining guy down to 1 HP? <sighs> so good! Alright, let's see. But show how fast can you get your ass here? That's really the only question. That's really, really what we need to do. We need to get his ass here fast. That was ridiculous, can I just say. Wait, you don't have damage with suppression, or do you? Please tell me you don't have danger zone yet. You do have danger zone. Crap. Oh, no, it's AoE. No, 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 no. That's not mayhem. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, good. I was worried for a minute there. Bring in the pain. Bring the pain. You'll be fine. Uh, Krungle, do that here. Um, yeah, do that. We're gonna get ready for Belchior to start capturing things, so... We don't want to take any shots. That's gonna be the important thing. No shots, no shots, no dots, more dots. I want to present mechs to him to shoot at, but not flank him, so... Now, if he tries to move out, he sees a mech, he'll take a ping at that rather than at anything else. But that's the perfect capture candidate, if I do say so myself. I love it. Let's see if we can grab him. That was like the world's greatest rocket, I gotta say. 
Everyone else is gonna enter. Maybe Natty should just kind of blow back a little bit. Her her HP is a bit low for this. Just steady up for now. And the rest of us are just end turns. We don't want anything to die. Yeah. Okay, Mutton. It's gonna Sentinel Overwatch, which is unfortunate. We can suppress that right off, so there's no biggie. Yep, we're gonna suppress that Sentinel Overwatch right off. Thank you. Oh shit! Oh god, I hate that crap. Oh, it's the second time I almost lost a gunner. I'm it's like a joke now. How do you lose a gunner in Archangel? And now suppression is down. Wow, that was crappy. Okay, so that's a that's a serious problem. But sure, can you get in? Oh my god, I almost lost another freaking gunner. That's awful. They always put these freaking annoying things on the things, and they always do the things. Strip off his overwatch so I can try and capture the guy. You didn't strip off his overwatch. What? How did he not fire at you? Now, but you're always going to get a face full of plasma. Just watch. Just watch. Well, it's a capture attempt. It's not going to be safe. No, I guess that was enough to suppress off the overwatch. Okay, overwatch rules are weird, man. They're weird. Get over here. On it. Lucky that wasn't a mutant elite. It would have gone bad. All right. Let's go. Zappy, zappy. Make with the zappy, zappy. Otherwise, guy needs to die. Time. Son of a bitch! Lot of good that did. Yeah, not a good, not a good set of attempts here. All right. Everyone here is practically master sergeant, so <sighs> I, I are frustrate right now. Oh wait, Natty needs a shot. What am I doing? Natty needs a kill. She just steadied this one up, so good night. Well, that was sad. And our gunner nearly died again. I really, really, really have bad luck with that. Okay. Well, I'm going to take a breather for now, and I will see you all next time as we try to finish this one off, deal with the floaters, deal with whatever's inside the nasty-ass UFO. And hopefully bring everyone home alive, because apparently our baby gunners are every mutant's favorite food. Goody goody gumdrops. Okay, I'll have a nurse till next time, till then.